Hey my awesome people this is Dr Shivam and I hope that you all are doing awesomely well Let us now hear something from our inspiration yes I'm talking of nobody else but yes Virat Kohli himself so a lot of us admire him and want to have a mindset like him so let us hear what he says in his step 1 I've never wanted to be average uh, since I was small. I think it's it's in my subconscious. It's something that I don't have to think about. Maybe that's the reason that pushes me, you know, every time that I do anything on the field to give my absolute best that I can. Unless my body doesn't break down, I, you know, till the time I'm fit and fine and and running around, I will give my 120%. And that is why guys I want you to have this killing mental mindset right so if you work with the mentality of winning you are going to get a lot more output from your day remove whatever negative thoughts whatever fear factors whatever procrastinations comes to you during your day while you are reading just write them up and cross them in your notebook because they are not going to help you in any damn way what is going to help you is having a solid and killer mindset that you are going to get this this year and you are ready to put in all the efforts that are needed i don't want that you feel pressurized by the amount of work you need to do but take this examination as a challenge and this challenge is something which will make you do the extra efforts that is needed on the everyday basis now let us hear his voice again and the step 2 i've always believed in myself i've always believed in my heart that if i work hard 120% every day of my life i'm not able to no one and i think it's an opportunity and it's a responsibility uh, i've been put in a place that i need to do the right things you know set the right examples and follow uh, a certain path that the whole team believes in and you have to know that you and i have that faith i have a faith that you can do it and so do you have in yourself because at the end this faith will help you to pass this hardship whatever you are facing right now now moving to the step 3 I understood that if I want to be the among the best in the world I need to be as fit as I possibly can be. How it helped me was physically being active and healthy helps you think better, helps you make better decisions. It's not a thing that many people understand but that's that's the fact. It helps you feel positive lying around doing nothing. It's it's an invitation for negativity. So right there step 3 tells us the important of having physical activity on daily basis. Yes, I understand that you have to study, but it's equally important that you take regular breaks, have once a day a walk in the evening or sometime when you are feeling saturated with the studies because it will refresh you up and give you that extra boost or that push that you need for continuing your studies so have a walk live your life because this is not the only thing that is important in your life i understand it is a a, a goal or a target that you are chasing but this is not all that you have in your life it is an important part but living your life is equally important so give yourself some time and devote the rest of the towards achieving your goals i hope this video have helped you or touched you somewhere and had helped you in your preparation do give us a feedback and let me know how it helped you too